Shotota Chado, the Mano Protista, ATMs. Third, another question, sir. Uh, how do you help students who are weak in English? Uh, first of all, what I do actually, um, unlike all other coaching centers or centers I say, in the country, I'm seeing all others or most others. ATMs is doing something that I strictly prohibited. I mean, I strictly said to all my staff, all my employees, not to recruit any student without any placement test. The first thing that we do, and we understand, we come to know about the students who's coming uh, for any enrollment of any courses, I mean, for example, IELTS, uh, phonetics, spoken and writing. We never recruit them until they undergo the co I mean, a placement test. The placement test would show, I mean, would help us understand the level he's in or she's in. Then, if we find anyone who's really poor in English or poorly poor in English, or very weak in English, what we do is something, we never let them go uh, to the course aisles. Many are doing. Yes, well, whoever coming, they're just I mean, uh, letting them go for aisles. We are not. We strictly, we are strictly maintaining so. What do you do if someone is really very weak? If they can really utter the word just by reading out or seeing their words, if they can recognize the words, or I can simply read out, or I can sim sim write, I mean, uh, sing something from some book, they will be able to feed the course we have, level one, we, what we call spoken. Yes, so what is the background there from? We mind, we don't mind, we never mind. No matter the I mean, person is a background, or an SSC, or graduated SSC, no matter the person doesn't ha uh, has any degree, or any certificate, if anyone has some capability to understand, I mean, so to read the word and to write some words I'm seeing from some books and all, can fit the course level one. And anyone undergoes the course level one, he or she definitely fits for the um, next course that we call writing on level two. And anyone coming for IELTS with the poor basic undergoes the two things can surely feed the course items. That's how we are the brand one now in the country. ATMs is a synonymous name of IELTS. You see, understand that yeah. so many, I mean, scores, every single week you see, every single week, back-to-back -back score. Yes. That, that too, seven plus, eight plus, or even nine and nine in uh, different modules. Yes. And I was speaking in CSDC, we scored uh, recently, in this week, yes, nine or nine, nine speaking. Yes, Very next to, I mean, uh, just previously, I mean, before him, who scored, I forgot the name, I'm Tassima, yes. Tassima who scored on seven and a half. Yes, and the previous one, Mahfuzah I mean, uh, Akhtar. yeah? Mahfuz Akhtar, yes, who scored on nine, yes, on nine in listening. We have got, I've got three state formula that really can make a student understand things, listening and all, and what of the background he is or she is from, yes, can uh, have the capability of scoring nine on nine listening. The yes, three step something miracle. Yes, and that's how actually I was, in the domain of files, ATMs is now the brand one in the country. Alhamdulillah, that's what I think of. The way I just do, I don't take it as a course. I take it as a challenge yes. to make and to, I mean, make a person promote the live level of files and to score at least seven. Yes. So every single student I here taken pastorally care of. So that's what you do. So I believe that actually this question you ask me is not a question. It is something, a big something that matters the most.